The CDC investigating an increase in reports of a cardiac condition in young people who've gotten the COVID vaccine. Now, while an, a link between the two has not been officially confirmed, the reports might strike fear in some parents. In this morning's Health Minute, an explanation on the condition and more on what experts have to say about it. It's a condition called myocarditis, an inflammation of the heart muscle. The body's immune system causes the swelling in response to an infection or some other trigger. Since April, the CDC says more cases of myocarditis have been reported in the U.S., especially in young people who have gotten either the Moderna or Pfizer COVID-19 vaccine. These are very rare cases, and in addition, they are mild. The CDC says most myocarditis cases have been in males 16 years and older, the onset typically within several days after a Pfizer or Moderna vaccination. Cases have appeared more often after the second dose than the first. Symptoms can include chest pain, shortness of breath, or palpitations. In most cases, the CDC says patients who have gotten myocarditis have responded well to medications and rest. To our knowledge, no one has died from this heart inflammation. It tends to be transitory, so it lasts for a period of time, but then it goes away and people generally fully recover. While the CDC is still investigating these cases, some parents may be concerned about their child getting vaccinated. However, U.S. health experts say COVID-19 should scare you more. For kids 12 and older who are eligible to receive the vaccine, if I had a child in this age range, I would absolutely get them vaccinated today. The CDC continues to recommend COVID-19 vaccination for everyone 12 years of age and older. The agency's director saying the benefits of vaccination overwhelm the rare risk of myocarditis. For Health Minute, I'm Mandy Gaither.